Well, one of the leading contenders here at the Cape Thoroughbred uh, sale is Aventur and Pippa, an exciting draft for you this year. Yes, well, well represented by VAR and um, obviously two fillies from the last crop of Jetmaster and then, you know, the new guys, Argonaut and Seventh Rock, so a cross-section for everybody. Well, VAR's probably the horse on everyone's lips as far as size go at the moment with the, the reigning horse of the year, Variety Club, uh, with everyone at its mercy. I think, um, you know, the, the jury's, you know, the decisions are made now. VAR's a serious horse. They sprint, they stay, they get the classic mile, fillies, colts, so I would assume he'd be, have a great sale, and we've got some very nice individuals, yeah. Well, 11 horses in your draft, seven colts and four fillies. What are some of the highlights we can look out for? I would assume lot uh, 226 is maybe on paper, the one, the full brother to Valdera, our equus champion sprinter who is now resident in the UK, safely in fold to Oasis Dream. He's a really smashing colt, very correct, um, a great walker, um, a very athletic, and not unlike her in temperament. And what about the other cults there? Something else we might be able to look for? I think uh, the full brother to Schiffer, who's a talented uh, three-year-old filly in training with Dennis Dreyer, the only filly to have beaten Via Africa, which is the VAR filly that's hoping to win the Group 1 on Saturday. He's a very smart colt. He's called Mastermind, um, robust, great walker, very, very, very good mover. And a highlight in the fillies? Fillies, I suppose, uh, the Jetmaster, uh, daughter of Sports Chestnut. Sports Chestnut was the Group 1 Phillies Guineas winner. This is her third or fourth fall. She's had three stakes winners already. Really classy, classy filly. And of course, looking at the stallions again, joining uh, Var this year will be Oratorio. You must be very excited to have him acquired him. Listen, very excited. It was a, a very quick deal when we put him together. Um, syndicate, the Var syndicate came to the party, so it's pretty much the same shareholders. He landed safely and uh, this week. Be very excited and um, great, great um, support so far from breeders. He's practically full for this year, yeah. Fantastic result and uh, another great sale to look forward to for you. I think so. For a start of our size, I mean, we run 35 mares and to have a, two stallions of that calibre on this farm, I think that's quite a coup and be very, very tough. But you know, horses and oven too are part of the family and Oratoria, the, the little bit I've met of him, he's very calm, very relaxed, very like VAR and so I, fit, I think he'll fit in perfectly.